and it just got funnier and you know you're inside with eight people there's just it's just chaos it's absolute chaos but it's it's a real blast Congrats on this show. One thing I love is the structure of each character. Even though you're playing one character, it kind of feels like three with the way it's broken up. You have the before, you have the deserted, and then you have the after. Um, yeah. Which part of the character were you most excited to kind of dive into of those three parts? I mean, I think all of them, honestly. I mean, after was really fun because because I feel like Henry kind of starts becoming a little more... Um, aware or, or he his his thoughts are kind of finalized in a way because he has you know he he has his thoughts and, and what he thinks but i think by the end he, he really has come to a conclusion which i think that was really fun to play but i mean i think i think that henry is a very different person than me so i guess you know diving into that and getting to play like that emo personality was really fun and, and different for me for sure i would say for me i really enjoyed Post Rescue Raw, because it was so vastly different from who he was when he starts. And in fact, um, we actually shot my interrogation really early on in production and then reshot it right before we wrapped. And it was such an incredible opportunity of, of Sarah, our, our incredible show creator and our director at the time, and me just kind of figuring out who this new rock was going to be. And we did so many iterations of it. And now finally getting to watch the show and see what the iteration they went with is so exciting for me as the actor after getting to watch and, and play for so long. So I'm really, I really love where we ended up and I'm really excited to see where he moves on. To be able to play a character over a longer time span means that it's, it's uh, the story assists you in being able to show uh, a human being with a greater spectrum of um, sort of emotions and see them in different circumstances. I mean, obviously before the island, it's a high school setting during the island, you know, you're on an island, life and death and all of that. And afterwards it's sort of, well, you just, with Kieran, you only get a very small snapshot into uh, what his mental state is, but it's also under the circumstance. It's also like in an interview situation and it's kind of like you know, very small, but even just aesthetically, that is like an interesting journey to look at, like, um, you know, with all the sunburn and everything. And then the after. How much of the scripts in the season do you get ahead of time do you already know like all at once or do you form your own theories going along if if iteration is held from you we got every episode like <laughs> right before pretty much we all started filming yeah. um so so like like when we got the script for me and uh, reed's episode we we read it and immediately facetimed each other afterwards and was like yo because <laughs> we didn't know like what was going to happen yeah. and every time we got a script um everybody would like hunker away for like an hour and then just like right. scroll right. through the whole thing. radio silence immediately yeah Pretty I mean, much, yeah they didn't they didn't tell us much <laughs> to be honest you know like like you said we would get it like a week out or something and then obsessed but it's like it was so crazy it felt even more of a deep obsession because it was like, this is what we're out here for. And, and we've only shot two episodes and who knows what's going to happen in the next episode. Like the, the writers know, but we <laughs> we're sitting here like, so uh, what do you think is going to happen? You know, <laughs> <laughs> we always have theories though. Like we're, me and Tanner talk about theories every time we get together. Hypothetically, which of the female characters would you love to see your character interact with? Who do you think would have the best dynamic? Sophia, Fatten, and, um, and Mia. Yeah, I reckon Kieran and Fatten are going to have her. So funny. She's, it'd be Fatten, so Fatten, uh, yeah, like, yeah, I'm just, it's I'm very intrigued. In the best way. Like, just, yeah, it'll, it'll happen. Give it time. I would love to see Josh and Fatten. I think that would be a hilarious combination because <laughs> they're, like, nothing alike. So I think she'd have a lot to teach him about how to chill out and just have a good time. <laughs> Um, I love, 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 love to see Ivan and Fatten as well. I think because they're both so smart and they both fill a very specific slot in each of their respective ensembles. Like, I think they'd be funny. I think they'd be a little mean. I think they'd have a lot of intelligent things to discuss. Um, power duo, in my opinion. I really want to see Bo interact with uh, Shelby. I'm, I'm, I, I, I can't put a finger on it, but like there's something about like Bo's very 
soft and he's very um like he's a huggable guy he's a he's a teddy bear and i would love to see the the optimism just ping back and forth between Bo and shelby i would i want to see uh something between scotty and leah because leah's kind of kooky and scotty is very very practical <laughs> and i just i just honestly like not for any plot point i think it would just be funny to see them in the same room and she's like tweaking and he's like this is crazy <laughs> you know what i mean <laughs> i say this because i was talking to the other day i was talking to erna and she was saying it was so funny watching because again they weren't with us when we shot any of our boy stuff obviously and she was like watching it i was just like tony would just kick the crap out of raw and so now I just desperately want to have a Roth and Tony scene just to see how those two forces would interact, um, especially Roth in the bunker post Island. I would say um, Henry and Dot. I think that would be very interesting. I feel like it'd be a survivor match off. Like which right? one actually has the most knowledge? <laughs> no. Right? Thank yeah. You. Dot and Henry on Survivor. Let's see who wins. <laughs> I am you. Everything that you have been through, the same thing happened to me.